Hi, this is Kapen from Kapen.com and here today I'm going to tell you how to install phpMyAdmin. Well, this is my page and I guess you'll like it. And I might try to make it very easy and simple. And this is for various versions like CentOS 7, 6, and Archive 5. But first of all, as I've said, I just need to paste this link and you need to install this repository for ME7. For this version, specifically for Reddit 7. So here I so this is going to install. Yes, this is installed. Now second thing second. Well, uh, to just you just need to run uh, yum hyphen apple enable wrapper equals to me install php my admin. Well, you do have EPL repository installed pre pre install repository. Then you need to just run this simple command. It's done. See how this. I mean, how simple is this? Will it take some time? Yeah, a little more. Well, I've tried to make this video as simple as that. I mean, you just need to copy and paste everything. I mean, I have you can copy your business website very easily. I post a link in the, the section below. Well, after doing this, you just need to uh, move the content of this PHP my admin to where www.html. Well, I have as per presumption have made this that you to pre-install this Apache uh, MySQL server in this on a server on my I must say on on computer. Uh, well, see, I have done this. Now I'm trying to move this directory, and well, see, see, our content is there. Just a little more, I mean, just give me some permissions. It's done. Now, the main part is we need to, uh, you know, restart the Apache server. Oh, sorry, I just forgot one thing. Uh, I need to rename this con file for this PHP my admin. Because it will, you know, forbid in this directory to get open on global interface. So again, doing. Specifically, I'm speaking. I'm just removing the directory so that Apache won't be able to load at a time of restarting. Let's hit the web browser now. Uh, these are steps that you can copy and paste. In. It's very easy. Reset the Apache server. And I guess here we go. Let's copy and paste. Can you no know, access this with your own, uh, I mean, IP and then PHP my admin. So here I'm hitting the my server and the sub. So now you'll see that the PHP is loading up. Now just enter your username and password for the MySQL server. And these username and password are the same which you gave you at the time of installation. You know, I mean, your installation of MySQL server. You yes, see, yeah, I'm logged in, yes. This is done. I hope uh, you like this video, and uh, definitely, it's kind of very easy and simple. You just need need, need not to do any configuration, or uh, it's going to be this. Well, uh, please like my channel and help me out to make me more videos. Thanks. Signing off. Bye.